Hello, Libra. Doing a bonus reading for y'all. Hooray. Remember, this is for a sun, moon, rising, and Venus. So check your charts if you wish. So delish. Some of you might be trying to walk away from some bullshit. Good on you, man. You're just like, I'm done. I'm just, I'm just done looking at it. You might take a trophy, but that's it. You're really kind of done with shit, man. You've been like just deal. Like you guys always deal with bullshit, like in such weird ways. Like I'll never, I'll never get that about shit. My father's in the book, so it's like I kind of get it, but I don't get it. But people are just people. This is the biggest understatement for people ever. Anyway, we're going to see what's going up with you, Libras. This is going to be Thunderdome reading, so there's going to be a two-part reading. You and your person, you figure out which one you are, and then apply, rinse, and repeat as desired. You know how it goes. Alright, so this is group one. Let's see what's going on with you. We got Ten of Swords. Someone feels betrayed. They've been stabbed in multiple places in a box. Um, want and wish is... Um... Weird? Okay, do you want someone to scold you? Cause dude, like I noticed the dude's smile on his face more than anything. Like, what the hell? Or are, are you hoping you'll get to scold somebody, tell them off? What you're afraid of or what you're rejecting is a lack of a victory. Or maybe even somebody trying to come in and, like, be an enemy in your house. The situation is happiness, group one. Okay. Obstacles and challenge coming against you. A lot of fucking fighting. Um, there's a goal, and everybody's after the goal, but it's still, like, a lot of fighting, right? What started this shit, how it'll end, come full circle, is the Hermit Reverse. Virgo's card. And the beginning theme is the Seven of Cups. Trying to find some fulfillment in your life. Or trying to find some way of fulfilling yourself, group one. I'll tell you what, Scorpio's bonus, I dropped all these cards on the floor. Don't know how. happened. Okay. So, group one. You know, I, I like the mischief in his face makes me feel like someone doesn't want to hear her. The scalding is just plugging his ears, but he's not leaving either. It's like... I don't know. Like, that's just weird me out. Because it's like, the obstacle is the conflict, so it's just like... There's not much conflict, you're just sitting there taking it, you know? Even with ears plugged. Alright, what's kinda like, got this person feeling stuck or betrayed, right? Is all these Bettys. There's Black Betty, Blonde Betty, Red Betty. Like, all of them just dancing in your backyard with cups and such being hoes and shit, right? Ten of Cups right here, this family sort of situation. Uh, ew. Might be a mistress involved for sure. Ew. Group one. Uh, okay. Now, the want and wish. Either you're wanting to scold somebody or you're wanting somebody to scold you. Like, get attention or something. Um, but it's like... You want them to do it? Wait. Okay, like, you can see through the tower. But, like, it, it wouldn't have any effect on it. Like, the illusion's already broken. Like, la lightning can zap it over and over again. It's almost like a fruitless, um... 
It's like, you know, why are you going to keep, like, hitting something if it, like, why are you going to keep beating a dead horse? That's what it feels like. You're beating a dead horse. Someone is. Um, someone wants to fight to be able to manifest that. Like, create something, but that's the obstacle. Yeah, definitely beating the dead horse. It's like it, it's like it's already known, so it's like, why are you hitting the tower again? Like, why are you bringing it up again if, if, if this has already been like... Like, like, like an ex bringing up some like bullshit you did like five years ago or some shit, you know? Something like that. It's just kind of like, well, we already know that. Why are we talking about it? Well, I just think it's fucked up. This was five years ago, like... I thought we were past this kind of thing, you know. One of those. Let's see. Ooh, there was some danger for a second. Uh, okay, there we go. Oh, it's back up again. That was right. Shouldn't have put it back after all. Okay. Um, lack of victory. Feeling like maybe there's an enemy in your house. People coming against you. That's a fear of rejection over here, group. Um, and you don't want to move in this disaster. That's fair. Um, this hermit right here, someone's like hiding away. It's like... This is how they started out with all this shit. And this is what'll come full circle. And we have the devil card, which is Capricorn's card. And it's like, someone's having the light shine in on them. It's like they finally like got their act together and like they counseled each other and be like, look, stop bringing shit up. Like, we're good. It's cool. Or some shit. I don't know. Um, King of Swords, the Shadow Side, and the World Shadow Side Reverse. Someone's living um, every day exactly like it's the same. And they were watching the storm that they don't want to move in because they're too afraid of a lack of victory they're watching it from a distance but it's like you know every day is exactly the same exactly the same like you take like you wake up exactly at the same time take a shower exactly at the same time nothing changes like imagine that and it's like here's disaster here's chaos and they're afraid to move forward to that but, they're still looking for something that's supposed to fulfill them, I guess? Okay, this whole situation right here. Especially with all the Bettys, the Mistress, all this shit. Could be a Cancer or a Pisces who's a Mistress, too. Possibly. Because I think that is a Mistress card. She's just naked and shit. Just exposing herself. Um... Uber betrayal. You know, Uber. It's just like they stuck him to the freaking ceiling so he'd sink on the swords even worse. You know? Um, this. Uh, whole, I feel like this is really a whole situation where someone's just. It's like someone keeps starting an argument over a dead situation and it's like, this shit's already been exposed, so why are we bringing it up again? Like, why are we starting this shit again? And it's like. This person is just offering bullshit to keep somebody hung up right here. On some bullshit that doesn't even, like, you know, it's almost like this person is giving breadcrumbs or just throwing out, like, really useless shit to keep someone pinned with all these swords so they can't move, period. Ah, alright. Third card. Or someone, I feel like, is trying to resolve an issue, despite the fact, like, like they, they're, I think they're scared of, like, dealing with their shit, and, because they don't want to lose. Which is like, you know, well, what have you got to lose? I don't know. Oh, crap. Uh, definitely not trying to wait on something that is fruitful. Not trying to wait on it. Not trying to invest into it anyway. But 
That is what I got for you, a group one, so we're gonna move the group two. Oh my god, okay, here's a card. I don't know I'm shuffling that one, because that's not the deck I need. Jesus. Okay. Sorry, group one. Or group two. Or whoever I'm talking to. Easily distracting today. Like, I rode a bike, and I haven't done that in a long time. And I literally could have, like, filled an entire, like, mop bucket with as much as I sweat, and it was like, ugh. Stay a little gross. Anyway, I don't know why I invited a little tidbit of information there, but you know, you're welcome to do what you want with it. It's all up to you. Anyway, group two, it's, this is for you, so they're going to see what's going on with you. Boof. We got two of cups right here. Dude's just showing his cup in this bitch's face, and she's just like, oh, I, I, I wasn't thirsty, but okay, I got my own, but okay. One and wishes to... Oh, well, okay. Um, you want to suck something dry, but it's going to kill you instead of the tree. Like, the tree's already dead anyway. But now it's like, um, you know, it's going to come back against you just a little bit. It's not going to work in your favor. Like, I, I'm already looking at that and it's just kind of like, hmm. Fears and rejections. Oh, dear lord. Like, this. Okay, so this dude just comes in and just tries to screw up everything, right? Uh, Knight of Wands. Leo Sag Aries. Coming in for battle on a nasty looking flea thing. The situation right now is Ace of Swords. Lack of clarity. Obstacle and challenge coming against you is a. Uh, Ten of pentacles right here. Like, feeling like everyone just steps on you. You're not appreciated. You're sick of it. You just want to dismantle, you know, buck the system. It's like you rely too much on this group, too. And that's why it's starting to kill off your soul a little bit. What started this and how it'll come full circle. Queen of Wands reverse. Could also be this um, Knight of Wands. I feel like she's saying her shit. Like giving commands or something, right? Beginning theme is King of Cups, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Likes to focus on what makes him happy to notice all the water around him. Or he's too focused on like his cup to um, notice all the liquid that surrounds him. Let's see. Let us. See. I feel like someone has like a wrong idea about like something in a relationship, but I'm not sure. So there's two cups here, right? Some offer is just stalled. It ain't happening. Could be Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. There is some Earth in here, but it's like it's like and eh, like nothing's coming the way that someone wants it to or whatever. Someone has the wrong idea though about a four of wands, like a marriage or just a relationship in general. Could be with a Gemini. Well, I guess because nothing's come to this, um, couples right here or whatever. Maybe that's why they have the wrong idea. Now, um, in Seven of Pentacles, someone's, like, drawing more out of the street than what they should, and now it's starting to hurt them negatively, and that's because they can't get over some spilt milk shit. 
it's just sucking their life away, the more they try to take from it, right? And then we got the Ten of Pentacles below down here. That is the reject. No, the obstacle and challenge coming against somebody. And it's just like they're tired of being in this position. Uh, but, like, they're not willing to, like, really invest very much. Or they invest in, like, the wrong people. Or they're just not very good at it. Not very good at giving to people, I guess. Oh, just chuck that right on the floor, I guess. No, it's like they don't have much to give. But they still gave shit anyway. So, um. Fear rejection, this um, Knight of Wands right here who's just running to start shit, while this King of Swords over here is just, you know, or not Swords, King of Cups, is just here minding their own business, looking at their own cup, right? It's like he's coming in to argue, and it's like this dude will not change his ways. Could be Scorpio right here. Like, doesn't want something to end, or doesn't want death coming in and bringing new shit in? We also have the Queen of Wands down here, how the shit will start and how it will end full circle. She is really impatient, really nettled, really angry counterpart somewhere, but not here. Uh, she's tired of feeling left out in the cold and wants to come back in. She's trying to walk over here to make an offer after like being so ragged for so long and it's like she doesn't this person does not have much to give I feel like not at all uh anything lack of communication with this king of cups with the Clarice's card the star all right let's see what the last three cards are group two Hmm. I feel like, like this person just, I, group two, I feel like it just, this is just an energy of someone who just doesn't want to, like, they don't want to bother because they don't want to lose. Like, not fail, but lose, and it's like, I don't know. Like, I feel like this person's got problems. <laughs> But that's just me. Um, yeah, lack of motivation or movement in any of this. Like, it, I mean, if this person does on like group two, if this if this is you or someone you're dealing with, you know, crosswalkers, switch it up all you like, you know. But this person is like, they're not. It's like they're aware. They just don't want to do it. And it's like, well, why? I don't understand. But whatever. I mean, like, it's not like I could ever... Okay, this person just does not want to go... They don't want to go... They have no passion towards their past peoples or whatever, a person. And they have no interest in um, going to this person in order to end things or start a new cycle or whatever. It's like this person's just... Whatever they are, I will say. You know? Hmm. I'm gonna draw one more. Uh, but there are decisions that need to be made. So, yeah. That's it. Alright. That was your reading, Libra. Thank you for watching my video. It's greatly appreciated. Um... If you want a personal reading, the description box has all the information below, as well as the background music info in case you want to chill with that stuff. Um, you guys take it easy. I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.